Watching Five News tonight, for decades we've taken it for granted that women have equal rights to men in the basic things, but that's not the case everywhere. In Saudi Arabia, women have to wear certain clothes, they have to get a man's permission to work or to travel, and they've even been banned from driving until this happened. Ladies and gentlemen, you may be interested to know that a few minutes ago, a royal decree has been issued in Saudi Arabia giving women the right to drive. That was the Saudi ambassador to the United Nations. So how much of a difference is this going to make? Najar al Atebi is a research fellow who is also Saudi and based here in the UK, working at the uh, Henry Jackson Society, a think tank. Good to see you, Najar. This is a breakthrough. It seems ridiculous to say that, but it is a breakthrough for Saudi women. It is indeed, because this is um, something that women fought for for over decades, a generation after generation. Uh, from 1991, uh, when women uh, started to defy the driving ban, um, a lot of women, um, they lost their jobs uh, campaigning for this, uh, to get this right. And we can see a, a woman driving in Saudi Arabia here, breaking the law then doing this, but this is a protest. Yes. Um, in fact, there is no law which prevents...